A lot of time. Yep, three hits from that leadoff spot for Grady Sizemore tonight. And on a night where runs were hard to come by, you were on base when Jimmy was able to go yard. And it's a good win for this team against a pretty good Atlanta Braves oh, team. Huge win, yeah. I thought uh, well pitched on both sides. You know, Cole did a great job of keeping us in it. And uh, just happy that we got some runs for him late. You know, you, your second time that you're able to play behind Cole Hamels, and you had a pretty good vantage point in center field watching him pitch. And, you know, when you, when you see a guy like that, uh, it has to be fun to play behind him. Oh, yeah. I mean, he, uh, you know, throws strikes, works the count, um, gets ahead of guys, and uh, works quick. It's just uh, it's fun to watch, fun to play behind, uh, a lot better than uh, trying to face him. <laughs> During the broadcast, we talked about you settling in with a new team and a new clubhouse, and it, it takes some time, but uh, you look very comfortable up there tonight. You look comfortable around these guys. You starting to feel that? Yeah, you know, these guys have been great. You know, they welcomed me from day one, and uh, having fun and just uh, getting to know him and enjoying playing. Just happy to be back. And Rhino has said that uh, he looks at the, uh, you as a guy that can play five times a week, maybe even even more at that point uh, as you continue to get stronger and stronger each day. Yeah, you know, I want to be out there every day. You know, I think for me, I, I need to kind of get back into shape by playing every day. So I'm hoping I'm in there as much as I can. All right, a big part of it tonight. Grady, thanks for your time. Guys, we'll send it back upstairs. All right, Murph.